lads, how's it going? Max here, and today, welcome back to episode 6 of the Tottenham Hotspur career mode. Now, you're probably like, where has this been? And I'm like myself, where have I been? I've just been chilling in my room, or eating a pot noodle, or just doing something stupid, I don't know. So I hardly ever upload this, I know, I need to, because I've got a lot of Spurs supporters, a lot of Spurs subscribers that I need to like upload, get this out there too. And you know what, I'm ready, I'm ready to like... Try and get the grind on. I don't know what's stopping me. I've been feeling a bit shit recently, but I'm feeling good. My car's had its MOT. It passed. Spurs played West Ham. We beat them. 4-1. Car, you Spurs. Never felt so good. Not going to lie. Deli Alley, my boy. I've ordered my Spurs shirt with Deli Alley on the back. It was either between him or Sutton, but Deli Alley being English. I thought, you know what? I'm hoping he's going to stay at the club for a long time. One of my favourite players. Let's stop talking. Jump into Spurs versus Palace. If you can hit that thumbs up button, that'd be greatly appreciated. Because I, I can feel the momentum, I can feel the support, and I've just seen Sinclair, top goal scorer. Alright, Villa, go get relegated. Crystal Palace at home. Now, Njai started off brilliantly when he came on last game. So we're going with him up top with Mbolo, Eriksson, Sun on the left, Lamella on the right. No, Dyer. Oh, talking about Deli Alley, we're going to give him a go. We're going to give him a game. Still on professional difficulty. I keep saying this. Do I up it? Do I not? You know what? Next game, I'm putting it on world class. See what happens. It's pouring it down at the lane like it does this time of year. Game on. Thing is, I need to know how many of you boys like want me to upload this more often. As we get a naughty little attack. Bang that. Go on. What a great start. Hit the thumbs up button. Because I need to know if you want to watch this series more. Embolo in the fourth minute. Just ruining Crystal Palace's dreams of beating us at the lane. Like I was saying, if you're enjoying this series, I mean, I can't really call it a series. It's like a one-off thing these days. Jesus. Then do leave a comment and tell me why you enjoy it. Because, I mean, I've been, I've been a bit on and off. Because, obviously, some videos do better than others. But at the moment, struggling with content, I'm going with this. I don't just want to upload the same things that everyone else uploads. This play here has been absolutely naughty. We're going to keep going. Ref, he's just pointed to the spot. NG winning a penalty. I sold Harry Kane by accident. I know a lot of you won't forgive me ever for that. And I'll never forgive myself. But NG is going to step up. And he's just put it in to the right corner of the net. NG just skipped. What are you doing? This controller, man. He was literally away then. Hello. Christian Eriksen from the free kick. If this could actually settle the game already. If we can get it up and over. But we can't. Bit of trickery. You ready? He's not, oh, I did not see that coming. Didn't see that coming, did ya? Son's kept that on. And he's just roasting. Over the line. Go on, son. Go on, son. Might as well just keep going. Keep going, son. Keep going, mate. This has probably been the easiest game I have ever played. So I will be putting the difficulty up after this one, lads. Enjoy to Ericsson. To Mbolo. Who's just going to do a little scoop turn. And he's just put it in. Too easy. Too easy. Game over. We'll look at this as like coming back onto career mode. Like I didn't know how easy it was going to be. No idea where he's going. Where's he going? He's just giving it to Vertonghen on the halfway line. Don't ask why he's on the halfway line. So we had half time. And honestly there wasn't much point talking about uh, anything at half time. Because I've just battered him. Brilliant first half from this fella. On top of his game out there, and I'm sure he'll be thinking about grabbing his hat-trick in the second half. Have I? It's war. Fantastic goal! What a goal that I've just conceded. That must have had about 30 passes. I'm not even kidding. Can you get that 1-2 right? The 1-2 is perfect! And that goalkeeper could just saunter Great. out. I can't believe that it... Where's my keeper gone? Lloris, what are you doing? This is what I mean. I just always throw things away. This is not, I'm not losing this game. And do you remember the reports of me trying to get Pato? And now there's reports actually that Spurs might be linked with him. I just I knew it was a sensible sensible target. Palace had just come out of nowhere in this second half. Lloris has just had a day off. No, I'm not I'm not throwing this away. There's no chance I'm throwing this away. Johan Kabai whips it in. We get it clear. We've got so much room here if we can get this. Go, Chadley. Go on, Chadley. Fresh on as a sub. Push that in front of you, son. He's lost the defender. We're three against one. All he's got to do is whip one across. Absolutely brilliant ball, and it's saved. Can't believe we didn't kill the game off there. We've just made the keeper kick it out for a throw. That should be game. And that is a full-time whistle. I feel like we thoroughly deserve that. Palace came back into the game. They were threatening in that second half. Liverpool lost at home 3-1 to Norwich as well. Go on, the Canaries. Ventilev asking to be involved in the more in the first team a bit more. 
Might have to loan him out in January. That takes us up to third. Chelsea sitting in second. Goners top. Don't need to mention that. We've got international duty here, lads. International duty. And you know who we're bringing back. I mean, what's going on here? Why is Adam Johnson like... Please just get out for Harry Kane. Oh, so many decisions here that I could just, I could do. Like, I want to make this my England team. So that's how we're going to do it. Should I take John Terry out? I'm taking John Terry out. I don't even care. We'll end up winning probably. Stones. Stones, you're getting in there, son. Deli Alley comes into the England lineup. See you later, Ashley Young. What other wingers we got? Sterling and Chambers. I probably need another winger. Walcott, as much as it pains me to say that. He's got that pace, so we need him in there. Chris Smalling as well. So our next game, we're away at Swansea. I'm loving this kit. I mean, we need to turn up. I'm bumping up the difficulty. If I get smashed, don't hate me in the comments, all right? Just do not hate me. We're going with the same lineup as well. The team that just smashed Palace. Well, they didn't smash him, but we got the victory. Here we go. Big, big win this could be. I just want to try and maybe just see how it goes because I have never played them world class before. So we'll pick the ball up on the win. We're going back down to Sun. Sun's going to look for an early ball. It's very early. Oh, as long as we don't do anything stupid and my defending's a lot better than it was, we should be okay. Gomez plays one out wide and for some reason, no one wanted to attack him. Oh, solid challenge from Batogland, but no one wants to get it. We need to be winning those second balls. Dyer's played through and Jai. He's going to pick out Ericsson, hopefully at the back stick. No, nice, nice quick pass in, get down that wing. Let's try and whip one in. Who's, who's making that back stick run? I love those sort of balls. That's too easy. And it's those sort of stats. He's had zero shots, Enjoy this, this far. I'm finding that a lot more difficult to make any chances. Whether that's what we want, I'm not sure, but Newcastle are beating City away. <sighs> not that I'm bothered. Nothing's working here. Nothing's working. Substitution, please. War Prowse is coming on for Ericsson. Gonna get gonna get Chadley on for Lamella. I'm gonna switch them. I'm gonna put Sun on the right. Um, we're gonna go with... That should do. That should do. No, no one can get a shot on me. We've won it back. Ericsson. Oh, there's one fly. Hello. What's going on? <laughs> Both teams playing reasonably well. I feel like they've had a lot more possession. Since I've up the, up the difficulty, which I guess is expected. The score today is going to be from a counter attack because they have been all over me. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. No keeper in the world would have saved that. What? What an unbelievable effort that was. We're going to have to do something special if we're going to get back into this game. That that was just good enough to win any sort of football match, that was. Our passing has been absolutely ridiculous today. Can't do anything. And he is. And oh my God, Shelby with a dodgy touch. And we live for another another break. Dyer, Dyer your passing's awful today, mate. In the last episode, Enjai was turning up. Scored a hat-trick. I just don't think like he's going to be able to do the repeat history. He's not going to be able to. He just can't do anything at the moment, unfortunately. And it looks like we are going to regret selling Harry Kane. We've lost that game 1-0. Pretty decent game. It was a hard one. It was very tough. I struggled. I could feel the difference of going up in difficulty. But if you want me to stick with that difficulty, then let me know. I haven't done any player development in this series. And as you just saw... That was the international friendly just about to come up. So you guys got to let me know. Shall I sim that? Shall I sim all of the England games? Or shall I play or just literally show you the highlights? Hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, hit that thumbs up button. And uh, who knows when I'll be back for the next episode. Because I just don't even know myself, to be honest. Take care. Bye-bye.